You're welcome to my channel. We're still continuing with our course unit business statistics and in this video we are going to be looking at a topic called correlation analysis. Yes, yeah, so we shall start by defining what correlation is. Correlation is a method that shows the relationship between two or more variables. Yes, yeah, so it shows the relationship about between two or more variables and variables are those things that change over time. Yeah, things that change over time and we have things like age, we have things like, for example, attendance. Attendance of students in class change over time. The way you were attending class in year one, first semester, is not the same way you you are attending class right now. So the attendance also changes. Age, as time goes by, age changes with time. Then uh, other things, for example, sales. Sales also change with time. Advertising changes with time and other things. So it shows the relationship between two variables, two or more variables. And variables are those things that change over time and space. Let's look at the reasons for studying correlation and regression analysis. The first re reason is that to know if there is a relationship between variables. For example, if we have two variables like sales and advertising, to know if there is a relationship between sales and advertising. If we have, if we have two variables like the cost of production and output, to know if there is a relationship between cost of production and output, to know if the cost of production affects the level of output. Yeah. So the first re re reason for studying or the first reason for correlation analysis is to know if there is a relationship between variables. Another reason is to know the nature of the relationship, whether it is a positive relationship, negative relationship, or a zero re relationship. Zero relationship means no relationship. Then to know another reason is to know the strength of the relationship. It can be weak positive or strong positive. It can be weak negative or strong negative. So th those are the three reasons for correlation and regression. To know if there is a relationship and if it's there to know the nature of the relationship. And after knowing the nature, you have to know the strength of the relationship. Let's look at how to know the strength of the relationship. We say the relationship can be a positive relationship or a negative relationship. And it is in the range of negative one and then positive one. So if the relationship is greater than 0 0.5, it is a positive strong relationship. If it is greater than 0 0.5, then if it is less than 0 0.5 but still positive it is a positive weak relationship between the variables and if the relationship is zero it means that there is no relationship and if the relationship is greater than negative 0 0.5 it means that there is a negative strong relationship between the variables and if the relationship is less than negative 0 0.5 it means that there is a weak negative relationship or a negative weak relationship between the variables. Then if the relationship is one, it means that there is a perfect positive relationship between the variables. And if the relationship is negative one, it means that there is a perfect negative relationship between the variables. And that is how we can determine the strength of the relationship between the variables. The correlation methods, there are mainly two correlation methods that we look at. And the first one is Carl Pearson's method, also known as the product method. Yeah. Then the, the second method is called the Spearman's method. And these are the methods that we shall be using in correlation analysis. Yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share with your friends and watch my next video. We are going to have 
an example we shall calculate something yeah about correlation